Hello, I'm Dwayne Cooper, the City Engineer for the City of Greenville. I'm here to give you a quick update on our Cleveland Park Bank Stabilization Project. The contractor's been hard at work at covering up the sewer lines and we hope to have the final grading and all the paving on the trail done within the next month. Hopefully this beautiful spring weather will help the plants grow and get the stabilization in place. And we hope within the next two to three weeks we'll have the Swamp Rabbit Trail back open on this section of Cleveland Park. Here near the bridge on McDaniel Avenue, the contractor's finished with planting the majority of the trees. They've also planted some willow stakes that helps hold the soil right at the river's edge. One of the water quality features that we use is called a rock vein. It's used to center the energy of the water before it goes around a turn to keep it from eroding the bank on the opposite side as the water moves through the channel. Construction on this section of the river is complete, but we'll be working on the south end later this summer. The trail has already reopened and Rewa has got their sewer line across Richland Creek. In this area, you'll see a water quality feature known as a geolift. We also use a rock vein to redirect the water into the middle of the channel. Our stream restoration work has moved north of the Washington Street Bridge. Here we're taking out an old railroad crossing that affected the way the water moved in the channel. This is the first time in over 100 years that we've seen the natural river bottom in this area. Rewa's Dig Greenville project is ongoing and you'll continue to see construction activity near the zoo. As the weather warms up, you'll see a lot more green coming out of the banks of the Reedy River. In the next two to three weeks, we hope to have all the swamp rabbit trails open and check back with us later for further updates.